Welcome back. This is part two of follow-up to my first video on the TAC-13. I've really enjoyed this platform. The more I shoot it, the more I like it. It required a slight break-in period, um, about 20 rounds to get it running fully like, it, like I wanted it. Um, I have since added a Viridian uh, laser light combo. That's a green laser and um, I choose the strobe light and laser on if I'm going to use it, run it that way. Uh, for those of you all afraid you're going to get shot through the camera, it is uh, cleared, safe, um, no safety issues here. I have um, ordered a custom um, sling for it, really enjoy the ability to customize uh, my weapons when I when I get a chance to and uh, I think this sling was very fitting of the character of both myself and this shotgun the um, only complaints I will have is with um, Remington customer service when I ordered this it shipped with one stud when I called Remington to ask him about an additional stud, uh, the guy said, um, just uh, use a single point sling. Well, that stud here would only fit in the attachment up front where the Picatinny rail is on the opposite side. This hole that came in the bird head grip, I don't know what that's for. But before I could even get to that, the uh, customer service rep said, why would someone want to put a sling on a home defense or range gun anyway? And that just completely turned me off. The, um, someone might would want to um, maybe um, put the shotgun down and restrain someone. Maybe uh, transition to a pistol. Um, a host of things. Law enforcement may use this as an entry weapon and have to restrain someone, handcuff them. Uh, what are they supposed to do? Lay it on the floor? Remington rep? Uh, other than that, I haven't had any problems. The, um, the sling was made by Lever Guns Custom Leather. I'm going to put a link to it at the bottom of the video. Uh, Remington Reps, however, did turn me on to a really nice company in Arizona. It is GG&G. Um, they make all sorts of custom parts for this particular platform. Spoke to a very helpful individual named Shane out there and um, we got some things going. Um, other than that, um, no complaints, no complaints. This is um, a truck gun, you know, and um, very handy. As you saw in the previous video, you can get some type groups. It's controllable. The uh, V3 system really works on this to dampen the recoil. I was impressed. 